Well, hello, my friends. And in this video, we're going to be going through how to add an opt in trigger to your ClickFunnels Funnel Hub. So, the Funnel Hub is a new concept where you have a main site inside ClickFunnels and you can add all your different funnels. And then, how do you add? So, when somebody takes an action directly on the homepage, what will happen? So the first thing that we're going to go is that we're going to go here on the side into sites, then an overview, and you're going to see here the overview area for your site. So the first thing that we're going to go, we're going to click this three little dots, and then we're going to click theme settings. We want to identify the actual page that is used as the home page. So we go and click in the advanced settings. We're going to click configure. And in here, we're going to go and we want to note the name. We want to see the name of the page that is in your funnel hub. So that's the main page where everybody lands. In my case, I customize mine. So mine is named CV homepage theme. So now that I know that name, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to get out. And I'm going to go now into the marketing section. That is where I have the workflows. And in here, I'm going to create a new workflow. And I'm going to put it funnel hub opt in workflow. And again, you can name it whatever you need it. I like to name it uh, very simple. Then I go and create the workflow. And now that I have my workflow in here, I can start creating the workflow as normal. So the first thing that I'm going to do is that I'm going to click. I'm going to add a trigger. And my trigger going to be. I'm going to make it active. And the event going to be. Come on. I'm going to look for an opt in. So that's when somebody give me their information in the main page. And normally you will select funnel. But what I'm going to do is that I'm going to go then into the page section. And in here, I can look for my example. If you remember, my page was called CV homepage theme. So that will be when something happened, there's an opt in in this page, then it take an action. I had to remember to activate the workflow. OK. And now I have the beginning of my workflow. With that trigger, so now I can go and click the plus sign and add any of the regular options that I have as part of my workflow. So you opt in, I will send you an email or I can make a decision based on, on that information. Or let's say that I want to uh, tag the user as that they came to my funnel hub. I can even uh, send them to a third party. So let's say when they sign up, you want to send them an SMS. You can do directly that. Or you can connect it to WhatsApp or you can even enroll them in a free course or some kind of course if you want to give them. So, my friends, this is a reminder for me, but also for each one of you that is looking how to add an opt in workflow to your phone. Hope. hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know.